Yeah. Solve the word up. Paired. <laughs> As you see right there, that right there, that yellow thing is the car top station that you run inside the hoistway on top of the elevator car. I'm always thinking it goes up. If you're an elevator. And that bucket right there is for the chains to hold the elevator together. Like you, you think one failure. That's your light switch for the car top and you have like a plug right there you can plug your device like your phone while you are working on top of the car and that silver box right there is um is what's the, what's that thing called the, the box that holds the rope together what this right here yeah that's just the that's just the wiring for the load wear these are the these are load wear it tells you how much it, it's just it sends a feedback telling you how much weight is being is being put on these ropes and that's all that is it, it doesn't there's nothing else uh, about that box these ropes here are five eights in diameter this rope here's a half inch a little smaller but and looks like that yellow thing is to there's a rail block and it holds oh it's the rail block that's a rail block and we tighten those onto the rail and it bites into it so we can and it won't move we have about five probably probably got about five thousand pounds on it right now they had elevators around on rope i'm excited oh got an entrapment and this looks to be a one-to-one -one rope and this is not two to one yeah that's what i said because a two to one rope and is when you have a traction elevator that has a rope coming down and it goes around a loop and goes all the way up and then it does the same thing for the counterway located in the back of the shaft in addition two to one rope and would also have a shiv in the middle so that is your view inside the elevator right shaft there. and you see that girder right there that is um used for the so separation okay, of the room. shaft for each of the elevator cars this rope comes up and over and back down. So there you go.